I would say there's big expertise just here in this field specifically. Yeah, so it was kind of a clear decision to me. We have many visitors from everywhere in Korea and overseas, so there's a lot of opportunity to collaborate. I, what I enjoy a lot is actually I can talk to anyone. India is now on the moon. India is now on the moon. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. And right? congratulations to everyone here. Thank you. My research interest nowadays is to investigate topological aspects in condensed matter physics. Goal was to investigate new phases of matter, which may lead to different interesting properties. I work in graph theory, essentially the mathematical study of connections. What I do is I look at certain substructures. So I say that what if we don't contain certain types of subgraph, what happens to the entire system? Basically speaking, we're trying to simulate functional groups by using an electrode where we attach our molecules to. By that we can tune to chemical reactivity that so far not seen or not possible in, in other, any other way. If you look at the world, what is really necessary to kind of improve technology, improve our lifestyle in the end, it all comes down to science and technology. If we want to have um, more advanced technology, we have to have uh, good researchers. So I try to be one. <laughs> I think even as a child, kind of the idea appealed to me because I like to take my time and think about things, try to understand why things work. And typically in industry, you have to do things quickly. But if you work in academia, you can think for a long time and try to really understand what is going on really because there's an extremely strong research group in my field, which is discrete math and graph theory. It's very unusual for a mathematics department to have multiple graph theorists. And here we have a huge team of 10 to 15 people total, depending on how you define graph theory. And uh, it was also Seng Lum. I was aware of his research and it's uh, extremely interesting to me at the intersection of graph and algorithms. So that was why. I'm myself a passionate video game player, so <laughs> I wanted to go abroad and I wanted to go to Asia and I just figured out about KAIST, that it's one of the most renowned universities worldwide, but especially in Korea. I got to go to Professor Ryong, uh, who's very famous in his field. Yeah, so it was kind of a clear decision to me to try and pursue to come here. I saw the CV, the advertisement, online advertisement here for the postdoctoral researcher. And this team, because Professor Munji Park and my research interests were similar, so I contacted him. That's, that's how I ended up. I would say there's a big expertise just here in this field specifically, but also the opportunity to come just given by, by the government because it's very inviting to come here. There's actually many foreign researchers in our group and our group is very, I think, friendly to foreigners. We have many um, visitors from everywhere in Korea and overseas, so there's a lot of opportunity to collaborate and be integrated in the research environment here. I, what I enjoy a lot is actually I can talk to anyone and there are seminars also and there are people visiting here like this is the there are many conferences and also people from all over the world they come here and collaborate so I can discuss and talk with them and I am benefited a lot from them that's what I enjoy. People are very engaged and if you have struggles or kind of questions. In the US, if I tell people I'm a scientific researcher, some people may actually react negatively. There's some stereotype that they should be like very nerdy and socially awkward. I actually feel like scientists are a lot more respected here than in the US. There is a preference of doing engineering in terms of career, easily getting a good job. It's similar for, for engineering. Say, if you look at the um, industry in Germany, there are a lot of jobs and a lot of necessity to get brilliant minds into that field. Jobs in the uh, tech sector, like being a software engineer for a famous company like Google or Facebook, is also considered a really desirable option for people. But going into academic research is often not. I think it's because career paths, being a postdoc and being a professor, um, are very competitive and don't tend to earn so much money. It's maybe not the safest option to go into academia. So academia, the jobs are a little difficult. Industry, you get maybe more easier. 
easily the jobs some states where there are there are some famous world known scientists like physics chemistry and mathematics as well researchers who have motivated their matlab in that region students a lot so that also influences i don't think that researchers need to have a better image this needs to be more attractive to young people if you really want to well attract young people korea is one of the uh, countries that invests a lot in research and development like way more than germany or or the usa or anything there's still this issue of money somehow and jobs so i think this is really what needs to be addressed that you have just better opportunities and a more maybe visible um image of exactly that that there are jobs that there are jobs with security and stability also in in old age and um that's i think the most important uh, idea it is more like asking questions and trying to understand it correctly or not the answer of that question people will appreciate that and you will end up from uh, success I think it would be great to be patient. I was uh, saying by um Fan Chung, a good problem fight back. You can struggle for months or even years to make progress, but that doesn't mean that you are failing. Many young students tend to assume if they don't make immediate progress, they are going to be bad at. If you're really dreaming about becoming a researcher, pursue it. Pursue it as much as you can. I mean, something that you might realize at some point is don't try to become a researcher, but that you are a researcher and that you are actually part of something push the world forward to well, whatever you pursue. So, go for it. Igonge. 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 Okay.